only a few hours' drive northwest of Italy's capital, Rome, at the foot of the Apennine Mountains, stands idyllic Florence. This flourishing Mediterranean city, full of historic buildings, is one of the highlights of a trip to Europe. Welcome to the city of Dante, Machiavelli and Michelangelo, and the place where Leonardo da Vinci learned how to paint. Welcome to Firenze. Florence's written history dates back to 59 BC, when Julius Caesar set up camp on the banks of the Arno River. Explore the compact Centro Storico, which was built on early Roman foundation and shop for leather sandals and handbags. For good luck, put a coin on the snout of Il Porcellino. Even though it's just a replica, it might just work. More than 1,400 years after the first Roman settlement, the church and the wealthy merchant families ruled Florence. The Medici family were responsible for the greatest buildings and most elaborate art. They handpicked master painters, architects and sculptors and created one of the most cultural cities in Europe. An example of their efforts is the Basilica di San Lorenzo. Designed by Filippo Brunelleschi, this is a prime example of Italian Renaissance architecture. He also built the dome of the 750 years old Santa Maria del Fiore Cathedral on the Piazza del Duomo. Lovers of religious art won't want to miss the Uffizi Gallery that spans the long city block between the Palazzo Vecchio and the Arno River. Even outdoors, there are sculptures everywhere you look, on the churches, the fountains and the piazzas. The larger-than-life statue of King David by Michelangelo is among the most famous sculptures in the world. This version on the Piazza della Signoria is just a replica. The original marble David is kept safe in the gallery of the Academy north of the piazza. Cross the 400-year-old Ponte Vecchio, which was spared from World War II bombardments because of its charm. On the other side of the river stands Palazzo Pitti. As one of the old residences of the Medici family, it houses some of their heirlooms in its expansive public galleries. Florence is one of those destinations where you find yourself constantly pointing your camera at yet another magnificent building. It's easy to imagine why this city has captured the hearts of so many travelers. When it's time to say arrivederci, remember to look back over the river one more time at the cradle of the Renaissance. <laughs>